Diesel. Diesel. You did so good. He's so good. So Diesel has a little bit of a heart murmur, and that's why we were in getting that EKG today. Next week, like I said, he's going in for his, uh, his teeth cleaning. He might have to get a few removed. And now we know that uh, his heart is strong enough before we go in. You'll put him under that heavy anesthetic to put him out for most of the day while they clean his mouth out. So now we have another project to take care of. Here in our kitchen, you may have noticed over the years or so that uh, we do not have a dishwasher. Do everything by hand. That's my nickname. <laughs> she said it, not me. <laughs> so that's, uh, she's been the primary dishwasher, and that can't be. My skin is not good, so doesn't like that. And there's so many dishes to do with him now that there's so much time wasted into constantly, constantly, constantly doing dishes, and her hands can't handle water as well as some can. She has, uh, what, eczema, right? Eczema on her hands. So, we have this space right in here. 24 inches. We can fit a dishwasher in there, I think. We're gonna go pick one up. And then we'll find a spot for the water cooler. <laughs> Never ends. Ta-da! We'll need to get it installed. Someone over here, though, is kinda cranky that he's not being snuggled anymore. My boy, we can't hold you 24-7, though we'd love to. Sometimes we got to get some other things done, you know? I know. We've already haven't been getting much done because we <laughs> want to hold him all day. Problem solved. Fussy boy. Unfussed. Just needed some magical boob juice. Is that the good stuff, man? Yeah? Looking at the camera. He likes this big fluffy thing on top of the camera, the big Mike. We Come call on. him Mike. His name's Mike. <laughs> it's up there. It's Mike. <laughs> so this is our new dishwasher. It's a Frigidaire. It's pretty much base. Model. Uh, was this the cheapest one we could really find? Well, one up from the bottom. Uh, this blue obviously will come off and it'll just be stainless steel to match the other appliances. Oh, is somebody not getting his juice over there? Oh, he's getting his vitamins. How dare you give him his vitamins? Had to put a couple of drops of D3. On his uh, on his bottle nipple there. Get that in his system. So this will be stainless steel. Once we remove that, it'll match the other appliances in the kitchen. I'm gonna have this uh, professionally installed. We called up uh, Brown's Plumbing in town here. I'm gonna make an appointment with them so that it all gets done properly and neatly in the back there. We also need to encase it. I have a cabinet built around it, so we have a ca countertop up on top of here. Sorry, I'll stop getting my hand in the shot. He's focusing on my hand. Yeah, it's going to be a cabinet level with uh, the rest of the stuff, right? Now, this kitchen is very small, but uh, it's never had a dishwasher in it, so it's not roughed in at all. So it's not hooked up to anything here. I just took it out of the box, checked it over, and just left it there. I'm going to make an appointment to get that done as soon as possible and figure out how we get a... A cabinet built around it. I don't know, do the plumbing guys come and build that? Or do I build that? Or can we buy that at Ikea and just put it together? Or, I don't know what I'm doing. So I know I've been getting quite a few comments about how the videos haven't been every day. By the time you watch this, we should have had about five consecutive days uploaded. Uh, through the whole uh, six weeks or so after and before Theo was born, we didn't make videos every day. And uh, we had uh, let you guys know ahead of time that there will be fewer videos. But don't worry, uh, it has been on my mind. Britt has been reminding me every day that I need to get back on track and start filming every day, even when we're at home. It is tougher. There's a, there's a lot more going on now, and Theo takes up a lot of our time. It's not that we just that I just want to hold them 
all day. It's that uh, there's endless chores to do and endless things to do to keep the house moving. But we did go and get a dishwasher now, which will make one thing a lot easier. Britt does the majority of the dishes, like 99% of them. Uh, and she likes to remind me that I need to do more. So I bought a dishwasher. <laughs> Actually, she bought the dishwasher. I bought it. She bought it. It was my idea. I demanded it. <laughs> she bought it. She got her tax return from this last year and uh, got a dishwasher for herself with it. So she deserves it with all the work she does. And her hands have like this eczema. Uh, the, the water in Winnipeg affects them a lot, a lot more than the water in Steinbeck. But somehow, uh, like, I don't know if she can explain it better than me. Like, you got issues with your hands, right? Yeah. They just get really dry and cracked and bleed, and then when they're too moist, they... And I said the word moist. <laughs> I hope there's some of you that hate that word. Um, when that happens, I get, like, water blisters all over my hands, and then they swell up really bad. And, yeah. So Painful. Water does not like your hands, or your hands water, don't like water that much. chemicals, scented soap, scented lotion, all kinds of things. So if it's... I put on too much lotion, even if it's hypoallergenic, too much will make them swell up. Just... It's physically painful for you to do so many dishes all the time, though. Yep. Physically, so... It is. We said, why don't we have a dishwasher in here? We have a very small kitchen, and we're not going to be staying here forever. This isn't our forever home, but it's our home for now. And we'll be here for a little while yet while we uh, save up for the crazy house market that's <laughs> around us right now. For now, uh, that's the best spot we could think of it. Is it okay to have it right beside the oven? Like, I don't know. I'm not a dishwasher guy. I don't... I've never had a house without a dishwasher. But Brett here grew up not having a dishwasher. I didn't know how to use one until I met Josh and Josh taught me how. I'm fancy. Yeah. I'm fancy. I don't wash dishes. I have a machine. I have a machine that does that. Such luxury. 2023, we got machines to do that work for us. I was a mere peasant when you met me. <laughs> a mere peasant. So it's a lot of work. The main thing is it takes a lot of time. Not only is it physically painful for her, for her, it takes a lot of time to keep up just with one baby. Imagine once we have another one, two, or three, plus all the dishes of the family. It's such a waste of time when we have machines that can do it for us. So it was cheap as what was it, four hundred and fifty bucks plus tax? Uh, yeah, five hundred bucks. Five hundred and eighty dollars. Yeah, after tax, uh, we got one year warranty on it. Um, I turned down the five year warranty. Oh, we're not gonna be here in the house that long. Plus, we have a man, a good man named Martin slash yeah. dad slash opa. We got a dad that can fix anything. pretty much anything. But if he can't fix it, it's not fixable. Very true. <laughs> So anyway, we got the one-year warranty. Um, we picked it up today so we didn't have to pay any delivery. But it came up to $580 Canadian uh, altogether. I'm guessing that'd be around like $475 to $500 US. And uh, I will have to pay to get it installed yet. I've looked into it. I could probably get it done myself. But I, I don't have the time either. I've got to start working. I've had a lot of time off recently uh, for very good reasons. Some very fussy reasons. <laughs> he just really likes food. As long as he's fed, he is the world's chillest baby. But if he's not fed, watch out. He's like his mommy. He gets hangry. Is it true? Is it true? <laughs> Don't talk to me right now. I'm busy. Very Very important. busy. Eating very important. Leave. Now. Or I'll scream. Back away. Yeah, that was our adventure for today, and yeah, I'm going to focus more so now on having a video out for you every day and get back on track with that, because we, I used to like upload every day and release at 4 a.m. Central Time every single day, like religiously almost. And, uh, and then life happened. And then life happened, yeah. But it was for a good reason. It's for a good reason, but I'm getting the wheels moving again. The greatest reason of all. So thank you for your patience, everybody. I know, I know, you've gotten used to seeing videos from me pretty much every day over the past 12 years or so. And I took a bit of a longer break than I ever have, than I ever did before. 
but I argue that it was for a very good reason for the birth of Theo. And yeah, I do miss making these videos every day because, honestly, they're not just for you. I also make them for my own selfish reasons. I also make them so that I can go back and look back on them. You remember that video I made? Have you seen it already? It's called Our Greatest Journey Yet. It's on my channel. Go look it up. It was very special for me to make. It took uh, quite a bit to put it together. It goes back and takes clips from different vlogs all the way back to 2014. And it uh, details the whole journey that it took us to get to Theo. And I'm so glad that I film every day because there's so many memories that would have just been completely forgotten. Had we not. And we can go back and look on them day by day. So what I'm trying to say is I really do enjoy what I'm doing. And yes, we're going to get back to releasing videos every single day. That's what this channel is all about. A video every single day. It's a lot of work. And there are days where I'm like, man, I don't really want to. But once I get going on it, and once I get filming, once I get editing, and I get in that mood, and I'm like, oh, I'm glad I'm doing it. I'm glad I'm doing it. So it something I really enjoy doing. So we'll see you tomorrow, anyways, for a video again. Don't forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button, the bell button, because there's going to be videos every single day coming out from now on, and you don't want to miss one. I release them usually in the evenings in Central Time around like supper time, 5 or 6 p.m. So just to make sure you don't miss them, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you tomorrow. Take care. Thanks for watching. Thank you.